How you doing, Mr. DJ? Back on the countdown. WLS, the Silver Dollar Survey from March 5th, 1965. One of my favorite songs on this survey. Bringing back some memories back in 1965. Let me play you a snippet of this record. If I can bring it up on bring it up on YouTube. Just just a little snippet. Check it out. I'm gonna fast forward it. Here it is. My folks California. You're thinking, that's the Beach Boys. That's a Beach Boys song I never heard. Well, hang on. You'd think that was Brian Wilson on lead vocals. Actually, that was not the Beach Boys, but they sure sounded like the Beach Boys. Two guys from Rhode Island. Uh, their names were Peter Andrews and Vincent Poncia. Let me go back a little bit on this. From Rhode Island, Peter Andrews and, and Vincent Poncia, formerly of a group called the Fidels back in the early 60s, V-I-D-E-L-S, in case I'm mispronouncing the word. These two guys, uh, they developed a songwriting team. They worked with Phil Spector writing songs for uh, Ron Nance. They wrote writing songs for the Crystals. And they started recording under the moniker Trade winds, and they came out with the song New York's a Lonely Town for a Surfer Boy. Cold winds of New York City. Woo, man, no surfing over there in the winter. Gotta go to the sunny climes of California. Get that nice suntan on you. A little bit of that suntan lotion. But watch out for that UV radiation, though. Woo, that'll get you. They'll catch up with you. But that's beside the point. Uh, they recorded under the trade winds. They also recorded under another name. They called themselves the Innocents. And they recorded uh, There's Got to Be a Word, which was a very minor hit, uh, with the number 34 back in 1966, a relatively minor hit for them. Later on, Vincent Poncia became a producer, major producer. He worked with Ringo Starr in the 70s, late 70s. Now, I don't know if you remember this, but Kiss, the group Kiss, back in the fall of 1978, they released, the, each member of Kiss released their own album. Peter Chris had his own album. Ace Frehley released his own, own album. Uh, Gene Simmons released his own album. The Peter Chris album was produced by Finney or Vincent Poncia. And Vincent Poncia also produced Dynasty by Kiss, 1979, which featured that really big hit, I Was Made for Loving You. Vincent Poncia and Peter, Peter Andrews, The Trade Winds, New York's a Lonely Town. Boy, what a fabulous record. Check it out. One other thing about this record, it went to number 32 on Billboard's Hot 100. It is a bona fide loss 45, but it's at number 28 on WLS's Silver Dollar uh, playlist, up from number 40, taking 12 big jumps from 40 to 28. New York's a lonely town. Trade wins.